All right, welcome back to Star Mound. Here we are in the spaceship, traveling to the jungle planet. And we're going to be scanning objects to find the avian clues. As you can tell, my armor's upgraded. The ship looks a lot different. I added the couch, the fairy lights. I think it looks pretty good. And kind of upgraded the smithing table, inventor's table. This is what we're working with now, so. I would eventually like to get the add-ons for the crafting table. We can upgrade armor. So that's what we're working with. Crafted a cape. So we're going to teleport down to this jungle planet and hopefully there's some avian clues down there. I don't know if we'll find any, but we just might, so who knows? I found a new sword. It's pretty cool, not gonna lie. All right. Let's see if the avians are on this planet. What is that thing? Dang, it's got a lot of health. I didn't really prepare, I didn't craft any bandages. This sword, it's good. Does some work. I'm just gonna stay away from that thing. It's like a turnip or something. I thought the avians might be in the desert planets as well, but... I don't know. Giant flower petal. Javelin. Jeez, are you kidding me? Just have to maneuver around them, I guess. Looks like a bridge built. Obviously, it's a bridge. Oh my gosh, but built by aliens. It looks like a bridge, guys, you know? I'm not sure, but I think that might be a bridge. Oh man. Getting my ass kicked on this planet so far. All the while, we're looking for avian clues. Pet collar. Oh yeah. When worn by a tamed monster, these collars can provide a wide range of benefits. I forgot that we can have a... I have to figure that out. I don't know if we can just make a capture pod. I'll have to figure that out. Because the pets can help you, like, in combat, which I feel like we need. Yo, what is that thing? You guys see that? It's looking at me funny. It's looking at me funny. I was able to craft one salve. That's sad. 
hope to find a village or something. It's kind of like Minecraft in that sense, you know? Find a village, talk to the people, trade, see what's up. I want to talk to the Amians. I'm kind of curious to see what their temples and stuff will look like. The Hylotls were pretty cool. The Florins were cool. Florins were kind of like a tribal... Um, Hunter-like society. It was pretty cool. I don't know if these are like considered clues. I don't think they are. They just look like ruins, so if we find a village or something, that'd be kinda cool. Shit. Oh man, now we're just now we're getting whomped. As soon as I find a, uh, who is this? Weird person. Do they have a bed in there I can sleep in? Sorry, but your bed's being used because I need to heal up. I also need to figure out what's going on in this planet. Probably the best planets to go. Alright, jungle planets. figure out how to craft a uh, capture pod. I feel like that'd be so useful. Yo, what the heck? I don't know if we'll find anything on this planet or not. It's looking more and more like we won't, but we'll see. I think we've been here before. This looks very familiar. I'm just going to explore a little bit further and see if I'm right. Might be new though, I don't know. Doesn't really look new. Aw oh, man, I shouldn't be attacking everything right now. What is going on? this place? What is this place? Somebody tell me what is this place? That's all that's in there. Nice. I am sleeping. These aren't avians. What'd they say they are? It's not an avian. I'm 
so confused. I thought the avians were on this planet. I thought that was the case, but I guess it wasn't. Is there not a moon around this planet? What is this? Did I speak too soon? Yo, what up? You want tango? Well, tango. It's kind of cool. This might get shady. Okay. What is this place? Kick now. There was a chest there. That's sad. Alright, so. Wrong planet, I guess. Honestly, I kind of just want to leave this solar system. Bunch of gentle stars. Alright, we need fuel. Which we can find. Whoa. Man. It's like a lunar. What is this? It's like a lunar planet. There fuel here. Okay. I don't know anything about the planets, so I have to figure out which ones are the best ones. Alright, I think if we go here we can find fuel. But yeah, I just kind of like, you know, rearranged the ship and I like it. Sit in a chair here, you can sit on the couch down here. It's noise. Beam down to this moon. And let's get some fuel. And it has two moons.
I'm looking for like the liquid fuel. I thought there was liquid fuel on these planets, but was I mistaken? No, I was not. It is in the earth. If we can find that fuel, we're golden. You can probably smelt down the ore into the fuel. I would assume. Thing. It's time to fuel up. I don't have to spend money on fuel anymore. I was spending so much, like, I would go to the Infinity Express and I would just spend so many pixels on fuel. And now I think about it, that was just, what the fuck is that? What? the fuck is that I'm out I'm out I'm going to beam out of there before it even you know kills me that was that's going to give me nightmares okay <laughs> jeez man this game does throw some curveballs at you the cat is freaking out he's like yo I know what you went through going to a different planet because clearly the planet we just explored was not avian territory now let's go to this star and see what's up we can get some sleep Jungle planets, that's pretty much what we need. Just gonna go. This is the jungle planet. Alright, might find some avian clues on this planet. I'm gonna turn on the music. I think the music is on, so I don't know what's going on with that. Maybe it doesn't play, like, while you're in the ship, I don't know. I do not know. But yeah, hope y'all are having a great, uh... Day, night, morning, I don't know, evening, wherever you are. I'm chilling, playing some games. This is just what I do in my spare time. Which, I'm getting less spare time, which is nice. I don't like to have too much idle time. <clears throat> because then, like, playing a video game feels like a reward. You know? You just kind of chill. You relax after a long day, and you're like, yep, video games. Alright. Let's beam down to this planet. Let's see what's up. going on what's going on 
Okay. Florence. Wait, if they're avians, would they be in the sky? I'm going to look this up, my friends. Yeah, I'm going to look this up. Okay, all I know is that the avians are found on jungle planets, so we just have to keep looking. I don't think I'll stick around this area too long. We know about the Florence. We've, we've, you know, been there, done that. Okay. Okay. That was rude. We're out. Onward to find avian culture. house Wow Hello guys have a lot of stuff. It's worth looting these places, I guess. Wow. Oh yeah, nano wrap bandages. I think we can start like making um, bandages and stuff. Advanced bandages. So, I'm going to look into that see what's up. I guess I should be looting, but... We're getting so many pixels. Hold on. This is ridiculous. It's ridiculous, man. I need the pixels. We need the pixels. A lot of Dura Steel as well. Very nice. Amazing. Finding these nano wrap bandages, and they are really helpful. So, apparently, core fragments are useful because you can craft the volatile powder, which is what I use to upgrade a lot of the stations and stuff like that. It's pretty cool, pretty cool. Upgrade modules, I believe, are for the ship. This 
game is so expansive, and it was only, I want to say it was only like 20 bucks, 15 bucks on Steam, which is crazy because for a game like this where you can really explore and get into, I think that's a pretty good price. Okay, that's not good. Oh no. Get attacked by these birds. Diamond pickaxe, guys. You know that thing's going to come in handy. Oh my gosh, dude. What? That's like paying homage to Minecraft right there, I think. It's amazing. I've played a lot of Minecraft, let me tell you. I played Minecraft when it like first came out pretty much. I think I played it back in 2013. Cuz I remember playing it on like Pocket Edition Lite. You could get Minecraft Lite and I just played the mother heckin heck out of that game. It was it was a good time. Nothing good. What is this place? And why does it look like high lottos live here? Do they live here? Okay, hold on. Y'all are going down. I gotta loot this place, okay? Y'all are going. Okay. We gotta stack the money. We gotta we gotta save up because we want to upgrade the ship. Underneath we go. Are you kidding me? All that for a tech card? That sucks. Like, I don't even know what the tech cards do, to be honest with you guys. This music's slapping, though. This is a banger. This is not, this is not a banger. I know bangers. That meme actually annoys me. I, I do not like that meme. What's going on, y'all? Like, why... Why am I in Spooky's uh, Jump Scare Mansion? Yo, what are these things, man? Get my ass kicked. How many pixels did I lose? Fuck! Didn't lose that many, that's good. <laughs> Okay, you know what? Honestly, guys, I think I'm just going to leave this episode here because I need to be able to find where the avians are. Not only that, but let me go to the teller shop and let me see what is available. I want to figure out some of the customization. See, I don't know what this is. This guy sells hover bikes.
which I'm like, yo, boat controller. Yeah, you can have a boat in this game. By teleporters, it's crazy. Sell food and produce produce to the Terra Mart from the comfort of your very own doorstep. It's so cool. And that's not all. I think there's there's more. Now the outpost is like kind of becoming more relevant. I don't know what this is. There, there might be something we could uh, purchase, but uh, I was wrong. Alright, I'm going to leave this episode right here. So if you guys um, are enjoying Starbound, let me know. Leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace out.